assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing like a day in the life video because i realize a lot of people have been saying they're tired of seeing the clothing hauls which i do understand i do get it don't feel offended at all quick disclaimer my life is very boring i don't do much today is actually my last day of holiday so i'm back out to work tomorrow <sighs> sorry sorry but alhamdulillah for everything so i'm just gonna show you guys what i'm gonna be doing so it's actually now 12 11 in the afternoon and since i've been on vacation this is the time i'm normally waking up but um yeah my room is actually a mess i need to go and tidy my bed but before i tidy my bed i just made some moroccan bread it's actually rising right now so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna clean up the kitchen then i clean my room take a shower and then i'll eat breakfast slash lunch because it's already 12. yeah let's get to the kitchen right now <laughs> so guys we're in my kitchen now my lovely little kitchen So guys the kitchen is now nice and clean so we're gonna move to the bedroom now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna fold some clothes tidy my table clean my bed so now we're back in my room and what i'm gonna start doing is folding the clothes so you guys can see all the clothes on the bed <laughs> so i'm gonna clean all the clothes first pack them away in my little ikea drawer so it's like look at that look at that and then i have space put my lovely pgs guys tell me these pgs aren't so cute i got this from sheen so cute i think they have pink pink blue and then white so i'll just fold these in here and then that's it for this part and then the second bit i'm just going to use for like my t-shirts and my moroccan house dresses like these are so much more comfortable than wearing like shorts and stuff around the house let me tell you all something doing these type of videos wearing gloves for one wearing naqab it is such a task i'm telling you You'll be out of breath so fast. Oh, wow. I always use this to clean and wipe down my surfaces. You know when you have white, it gets really dirty really fast. So just a quick spritz. Then one paper towel because in this cost of living you do not need to be using it too okay one paper towel is good enough so this dresser is the newest addition to my room almost everything i got from sheen even the mirror look at the mirror it's from sheen like what same drill let's get a bit spritz i don't really need to clean this because i cleaned this like twice yesterday because i was trying to film a video yesterday with me cleaning and it just did not turn out how it was supposed to so i don't really need to do like a big deep clean and i like this because it moves as well oh mashallah oh it has risen okay now nah, yeah, i think it's definitely ready it's risen so much like it was such a tiny little ball so I'm going to get this prepped and then I'll come back and show you how it's going to look when I put it to bake. So I'm going to pop this in the oven now and I can't tell you how long to let it bake for because I normally just leave it until it starts to get golden. So it always works for me. So yeah, I'm going to put this in the oven then I'll come back and show you guys how it looks when it's finished. I'm so excited. So guys, this is what it's looking like now. I kind of made it got too golden brown. <laughs> But that's because I was so occupied with something else. But the color is perfectly fine for me. I know it's going to taste so good. But yeah, time to take a shower. 
So guys, we're in my little lovely bathroom now and I'm about to go and take a shower. So I'm just going to show you guys the stuff that I use to shower. So the first thing, I know we're going to have to start boycotting this, but I already have it. So the first thing I go in with is this Dove. It smells so good. The next thing I will go in with is the Inky List Salicylic Acid Cleanser. I use this both on my face and on my body. It just keeps the skin clean, keep it from hyperpigmentation. And you know, salicylic acid is actually really good for the skin. Even though I am running out, if you're Caribbean, you get it. Like, I cannot take a shower without Dettol. I use this as like my final rinse. And so my skin literally smells like Dettol straight out of the shower. And then to wash my skin, I use the African Net Sponge. Cannot bathe without this. Without this, I do not feel clean. So definitely invest in it and it's washing machine safe as well then the next thing just plain old colgate to brush my teeth <laughs> nothing special about this and i think i might have to do a hustle so this is what i'm just gonna use to wash my hair i mostly use this because i only really wash my hair on hustle days or if my hair is really dirty and i can't wait so yeah that's about it i'm gonna take my shower now so guys i'm fresh out the shower and i'm going to show you guys my after shower routine obviously i can't show myself as yet i apply this altia organics organic bulgarian rose water i spray this on every single part of my body and then i also go in with the altia organics bulgarian lavender water so the next step is to go in with my glycolic acid I don't use deodorant at home because this is perfect for body odor. So I go in with a cotton pad and I use the both of them. I know this might seem a little bit crazy but I use baby oil to moisturize my skin because being a black woman and living in a cold country, our skin tends to get a bit dry faster so I find baby oil is the only thing that really keeps my skin moisturized. And then for my face, I go in with this Primark Vitamin E Moisturizer, trust me it's actually really good for my lips i use this vaseline rosy lip so because i just did a rosol as well i'm gonna go in with my little combination oil it's rosemary oil vitamin e oil and it's this other oil this green oil that was trending on tiktok i'll put the picture on the screen because i honestly cannot remember but i just stored it all in this little bottle so the next thing i go in with is this oud oil and i got this from ebay actually it was 3.99 it smells so good and i use this only for my underarms when i'm at home and then to top it off i sprayed this white oud all over my skin when i tell you this will have you smelling sweet for a whole day it is so good i think it was 10.99 totally worth the price it's a 100 milliliter bottle subhanallah like it's really good i do recommend this one because it's cheap and it smells rich and expensive and it does last so now i am all ready i come to my lovely corner to pick out an outfit so i think i'm gonna do this maxi khima from sheen black plain abaya so guys i am finally dressed this is the maxi khima from sheen it's so long like what i think it's really really suitable for prayer like the material is so nice as well so i'm just here sitting and this maxi khima from sheen like subhanallah like look at it it covers your entire body this is the perfect thing to pray in i literally have like a minute left before it's time to pray it's right there in the corner a minute and 50 seconds i just love this phone case i also got this from sheen it's so nice Allahu Akbar. And the notification comes up. Now we're my nakab now. So yeah, I'm gonna pray Asr and then I'm gonna come back because I am starving. I'm craving a coffee. So when I'm done, I'll be back. So I'm finally finished getting ready. Finished praying my solar. And I'm feeling so beautiful. Look at Allah's beautiful name. Allahu Akbar. So beautiful. Got it from AliExpress. It was so cheap as well. This is my outfit for the day. Mashallah. 
it's it looks so beautiful i'm in love with this maxi Chima. like sheen is doing their thing so we're gonna get this very late breakfast so this is what the bread is looking like now it's nice and cool down i didn't rise as much as i expected or maybe i think i didn't put enough yeast inside of it but yeah this is how it's looking i don't think i put enough yeast but it's cooked no raw dough everything is nice so all my days look at this <laughs> so we are back in my room and this is what i'm gonna eat with the bread i'll show you guys again it looks good if i do say so myself like mashallah and then i have my coffee and i just want to quickly show the people who are always commenting oh this is crazy how do you eat how do you drink if i'm out in public simple simple same with the bread i would say bismillah first <laughs> wow that is so good that's actually so moist wow i need to eat i'm so hungry so guys i just ate i feel good alhamdulillah so what i wanted to try out guys is this bahor burner because i haven't tried it since i bought it and i'm actually really curious how it works take a quick reader to see what it says it comes with this black bag i'm gonna show you guys how it looks And as I said, I think I have the plug in. Ooh, it turned on. So I don't know if. Oh, okay, okay, now turn it off. Okay, it turned red inside. So this is the bahor I'm gonna be using. If you do not like strong smells, do not use this. This is extremely, extremely strong. I got this from Amazon. I think it was only three pounds. And let me show you guys close up how it looks it smells wow like i just opened the packet and wow it smells so good the top is off and this little bit in here it turns red when you hold down this button i don't know if i'm supposed to crush it up but i think i'll just leave it and that's it i'm not even using too much of this because as i said this is extremely sweet i'll hold it down oh my days you guys can see that Wow, so bad. <laughs> wow, what? That works so. Oh, and it smells so good. Subhanallah. Wow. Guys, I'm shook. That works so fast. <laughs> this at Sheen, guys. Y'all need to tap into it. Tap into it. Because what? Subhanallah. And it smells. Oh, it smells so good. So much easier than using the charcoal and burning it. So guys, I think I'm going to end the video with a little room tour. Because as I said, I changed some stuff around in my room. So I'm just going to do a little room tour for you guys. And then that will be it, the end of the video, because I literally have nothing else to show you guys. My life is so boring. <laughs> but I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.
so yeah guys that's the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you like to see videos like this let me know and i'll continue to make some more inshallah you can always tell me down below if there's any videos you would like to see and thank you guys so much for your support your kindness your love and just thank you so much for being good people may allah reward each and every one of you watching this video assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh